finale of ABC's Abbott Elementary did not air in its entirety here locally tonight because of severe weather coverage. But you might want to check out the episode tomorrow on ABC.com. That's because an Omaha third grader at Westside's Westgate Elementary found herself a spot on the show. KETV News Watch 7's Quinicia Fraser sat down with her to learn how the nine year old made it happen. Nine year old Etta Hughes is full of hopes and dreams, much like other third graders her age. My ultimate dream is to go to the moon and probably be the first TikToker to go to the moon. And while it may not be as extreme, she's about to see one of her dreams come true. I don't know what I'm going to say when I'm me, but with it, with acting, it's like there's lines and I'm playing someone else, so I know exactly what they're going to say because the conversation's already planned out. Usually, you'll find Etta inside a classroom at Westgate Elementary, but on April 12th. Watch out for glasses, you'll know it's me. Whatever it takes to keep you out of my hair. Sir, you are bald. She made her nationwide primetime debut in the season finale of ABC's hit show, Abbott Elementary. And even though she's playing someone else, Etta tells me her character in the show is not that far off from how she is in the classroom. She's honest, but she's brutally honest, and she makes a joke out of it. Etta knew she wanted to act at an early age. I realized when I was about four years old because I did musical theater when I was three. But her appearance on Abbott Elementary is her first ever TV gig. As for how she got it. I stole my mother's phone to go on YouTube because I didn't have my iPad. So I was going to YouTube and this ad kept on popping up like be one of the first 200 people to sign up and you can get an audition. Etta didn't even know what show she signed up to audition for back in January 2021. Did you sign up for the audition yourself? Yeah, I signed up for the audition. Um, luckily, I know her email and password. She sent an audition tape in October before getting a call back. By November, it was time to shoot the episode. It feels like you're nervous, but you want to jump and scream and cry at the exact same time. And while she's excited to start this new chapter in her young life, Etta says she'll never forget Omaha, the city that started it all. I have family here and I would never forget any, anyone or anywhere that really helped me get to where I am. Quinicia Fraser, KETV, Newswatch 7.